I'm gonna get that chipmunk. I'm gonna get him. Honey, I don't think you're gonna get him. Friday and I am not going to work today uh, I just had therapy and I'm really tired because well therapy went well but I'm really tired because Daniel was up last night with a fever he was 101 um, and he just felt hot and kind of weak um, and that was about 12:30 midnight so I gave him some Advil and uh, he was coughing a little bit, but didn't sound like horrendously congested or anything. So then we went back to bed, got up again, went back to bed, got up again, went you know, back and forth, che checking on him. This morning he was happy and smiling, and the fever was gone, but he was still covered under the Advil. So I decided to send him to school with Dave, because there's only two kids in his room. Two kids and two, one other kid and... A therapist and two nurses and uh, I think he's in pretty good shape so I'm driving the big van around in case I have to pick him up. For now I'm going to the grocery store because I need to get some things for the house just to talking to my therapist about the fact that it's just so overwhelming for me to have work and have the house and have the kids and have Daniel and have all this stuff and I'm very unfinished at everything I do and it's very frustrating. Even my calendar is like, everything is crossed off, rescheduled. I never know when I'm gonna be anywhere because I don't sleep during the night and so I'm really tired. <laughs> and I can't function on no sleep for like, after I go get the things I need at the store, I will probably take a nap before I, you know, do anything else, hopefully. Daniel's okay. I think he is. You know these kids, they always send me Daniel's history that if he's going to have anything serious happen to him, usually it's on a Saturday or a Sunday when I have to make a decision as to whether or not to go to the hospital. It never happens on a weekday. But it's easy. Okay, went to CVS now. I'm heading into um, the grocery store and then I'll head home. And I'll hurry up, buddy. I'll be right back. Just going to get a couple things. The dog <laughs> smelled the chicken. Henry, because the chicken is right here. I got cooked chicken. Look at this. Look where he is, all the way in the back. You almost got back here, you know. If I was driving another five minutes, I'd be in trouble. So stay away from the chicken. You hear me? Yeah, you look guilty. You look guilty, you little rascal. Chicken stealer. All right, let me get you out of the truck. So, I went grocery shopping. I came home. I was like, I'm going to take a nap. And then I'll feel better. I'll wake up and I'll just clean the house and do stuff, you know? And I woke up feeling yucky. <laughs> Damn. That's so funny. Huh? Hi. What? Where's Nemo? Hmm? Uh, you watching Nemo? Uh, yeah? Really? Uh, <laughs> Find a happy place, find a happy place! 
It's the big saw. Listen to this. <laughs> That's my yard. It's like stucky, mucky. There's Henry over there. I have him on the long line so he can go exploring. <laughs> he loves that. He loves that. What do you smell over there? Get sprayed by skunks. <laughs> he sees something. What do you see? Whoops. He sees something. Gardening becomes really difficult. In this area, used to have like all beautiful perennials. And uh, yeah, Henry has got himself all stuck in the trees already. But anyway, it's really hard to maintain for me because the deer eat it. So I set up some pachysandra there and it should fill in nice and around. See, it goes down the back. Anyway, we'll do something in this one. Come on. Come on. Come on. Something must live in the, in the rocks. What do you smell? Come on. Take him in there. There's a little cave down there. Come on, stop it. Too much wildlife in the yard. Somebody lived down there, Henry? Huh? Did you hear something? I know there's a lot of snakes in the summer, so I don't go near this area. Nasty snakes. Huh. <laughs> You're such a good hunter, Henry. You're such a good little hunter. I just saw it. You know what it is? It's a chipmunk. Come here, I saw him. He was hiding on you and he ran right out. You have a good sniffer there, friend. Did you sniff out the chipmunk? There's the hole. Here. Come here. Here's his, see? There's his hole, Henry. Look. He went down this hole, mm. silly. Chipmunk. We have all kinds of little holes. I think they have a, I think there's a whole village, a city, a whole community underneath the ground. He's not gonna come back up, is he? I'm gonna get that chipmunk. I'm gonna get him. Honey, I don't think you're gonna get him. You know what, you're gonna get a bath. We get inside the house later. Because you were stinky before this. Now you're gonna be gross. Look at him. What is it? I've gotta get it. I know he's in there somewhere. Is there a dog on the couch? Is there a dog in the couch? How'd you get in the couch? I'm gonna get you. Are you in the couch? I'm get you. Are you in the couch? What are you doing with Thomas? Is, are you a new throw pillow? Huh? Are you a new type of throw pillow? Yeah. Oh, you are? That little boy. <coughs> okay, I'm gonna go make meatballs. Bye -bye. Oh, come on, are you kidding me? It's snowing out. This is like, just cruelty to humans. This morning, snowing again. Snow, cold. Come on. Here goes Thomas. There go. He's going bowling. Snowing. What do you think of that, my friend? Huh? Look at him. He's getting all long-haired again. You need a haircut, Henry. Don't you? You're so cute. Fire. Cat. Cat over there. Dog over here. And snow. Happy Saturday, March 2-8. And uh, 
Oh, why? Why is it snowing? It should be raining. It can't snow like this on March 28th. Oh well, it's okay. Night's sleep last night. Part of it's my own fault because before I went to bed, I decided I was going to catch up on the Walking Dead episodes. <laughs> For some reason, I had anxiety after that. <laughs> I, I was behind a few episodes and now I'm like, ah, no way. <laughs> and uh, I don't watch very much TV at all. As a matter of fact, whenever I seem to sit down to watch a program is when John kind of gets aggravated with me. I think um, <laughs> he's just not used to seeing me watch TV. So like whenever I do, he's like, are you going to do these dishes? Because I don't... Sometimes I just plop down and start watching TV. Apparently that's not good to do in his eyes. So, ah, Henry, the snow is too sinky. What the fu fudge nuggets. Okay, so, isn't this lovely? I feel like I'm back in Alaska. Anyway, I'm tired today. I need to, uh, I don't know what I need to do. You just go back to bed. Sleep two more hours and wake up again. Eo. Where are you going? Maybe we'll do eggs later. Just not in the mood to do Easter eggs when it's snowing out. <sighs> What's the matter, Theo? <clears throat> you hungry? Yeah? Wow. Okay. I'll feed you. I'll feed a dog. Mm. Yeah, me too. Is that just plain water, Julie? the uh, Sandy Hook 5K up at Fairfield Hills this morning. Nice. But he ran in the snow, I guess. Sure the pool's open? I don't know. The schedule says 1 o'clock. Do you want to call? Why don't you call the Y? Yes. Oh, punch buggy, don't punch your back. Ow! Oh, look, there's a punch buggy there. I didn't hit you that hard. It's a big puppy coat on. I did not make a proclamation that I was partaking in the punch buggy game. You're not, you're not partaking in punch buggy? No, because I never win. I'm sorry. And I, I realize that. And I always get punched. It's because you're too busy videoing and not watching the cars coming. Thomas punched up me the other day. Almost made me drive off the road. I'm gonna try swimming again. Hopefully we don't um, damage Daniel's spine this time. It's a windy and snowy day and we are taking Daniel's little goodies. Oh. Door's locked. Back here. What? Daniel enjoyed the swim. He did? He did. He's exhausted. He was working hard there for the first like half hour kicking and yeah, kicking. Yeah, yeah. He either needs a nap or uh, a cup of coffee. Yeah. He has a cup of coffee. Well we turn off his feed too so that it's on now, right? Yeah. Alright, so I think we should go get some coffee. 
So I was walking out of the gym and I heard this noise and I found a Ben's Bell. And I've been hoping to find a Ben's Bell. <laughs> it's, a, it's an act of kindness thing. You take it home and hang it. Remember to spread kindness throughout the world. There's no such thing as a small act of kindness. Every act creates a ripple with no logical end. Scott Adams. This one interaction at a time. These are handmade bells. Get in the car, Julie. It's cold. Why are you making fun of me? This is really cute. Why'd you go make some? I don't know where you go to make them. Google on Ben's bell. Yeah. The toy tree? You no, know, the toy store? You can buy one to take it to Florida and put it up in the you know, Okay. So that was a good swim. And now we're going home with some coffees. Got my... What did I get today? Hazelnut? What did you get? Regular? Regular. So yeah. Finding a Ben's Bell was kind of cool. Coming out of the swimming pool. today. I just kind of like blue. <laughs> Henry. You know, you put the camera on the dog and then he starts licking himself. Hen. Henry. <gasps> Hi. What are you doing? What are you doing? Cheese. Cheese. Hi, Theo. He was looking at the snow going, what in the world? Still snowing at 346. Yeah. Yes, it's step it, Hemi. Oh. Hi, Henry. What's Theo doing? Hi. I got a little friend here. I'm editing my video. Look at my friend. Hi. You're so funny. You're playful. Dog attack, dog attack, dog attack. Oh! oh. <laughs> what are you doing to me? Oh. I love you. Oh, goodness. Thank you, man. Okay, let's go. You are crying for some attention. What do you want to do, huh? Do you have to go side? Do you need to go potty? Do you need to go potty? Go potty? Go side? Go side? Seriously, Henry. Ow. <laughs> you good boy. This is so silly. It's so silly. How's the fire, Theo? Don't you touch my new headphones. <laughs> Again. <laughs> really, you okay, Abba Gabba? Is this like throwback time to your favorite shows of the past? You love Yo Gabba? You remember this? Who's that guy? He's crazy, right? Listen, I'm gonna go walk Henry, okay? <laughs> yeah, Daddy's right out there. You feel okay? <laughs> so now it's after five o'clock on Saturday, and you know what? It's still snowing. It's still snowing. It's still freaking snowing. But at this point, who cares, right? This isn't gonna stay, right? It's gonna melt away, right? 
snow, 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 S N O W, snow. Come on, Henry. This is my Ben's bell. And I love it so much. I'll put the link in my description of this video. So if anyone is curious about what Ben's Bells are and stand for, they can look it up, but I found one today. It was just right at the Y. Ben's Bells. And it said, You have found a Ben's Bell. Remember to spend kindness.